Seoul is a lot of things. It's a huge metropolis built among the mountains of South Korea. It's both ancient and modern. It's by far the biggest city in Korea. But there are plenty of places to find some peace and quiet. The stresses of daily life can be relieved by spending some time discovering the city's history. Visit one of the city's ancient royal palaces, such as Gyeongbokgung, for a dose of Korean history and culture. Stroll through Gwangwamun Plaza, where local kids love splashing in the fountain. At the Namsangul Hanok village, you can check out traditional Hanok houses and see how people used to live in Seoul. Off in the distance, you'll see the N Seoul Tower. Head to the top for great panoramic views of the city. Getting around is a piece of cake on the subway, as there's an extensive network hooking up all points in the city. You can also catch a cab, including some that are for foreigners only. Seoul, being a hip, fashionable city, has many options for shopping. Head to the Insadong Shopping Center, home to many shops and galleries. You may see some familiar faces here. This area is popular with locals and tourists, so it's bustling any day of the week. While you're at it, you might as well check out Namde Moon Market. You can find everything you want. Be it street food, jewelry, clothes, souvenirs, electronics, you name it, they got it. If you want some authentic Korean food, you have to eat at Kimbap Heaven. From Kimbap, to ramen noodles, to pork chops filled with cheese, this cheap local eatery is essential. There are plenty of hostels to stay at in Seoul. The Bong House is among the best. With friendly staff, affordable prices, clean and comfortable rooms, and a great atmosphere. It's a nice place to call home for a few days. The Bong Bar is located next door, where guests get a free beer each night they stay. And it's an awesome place to make friends with fellow travelers. Hit the streets in the evening, and you're sure to find tons of delicious things being whipped up by local vendors. Grab a snack and head out in search of one particular hole-in-the-wall restaurant. So we're in a small hole-in-the-wall restaurant that we found thanks to some local Koreans here. So some kimchi jjigae, kimchi stew, and a variety of side dishes here. After dinner, head down to Chonggye Chun. Stroll along the river and you can enjoy a laser light show. You'll also see the digital canvas, a trippy display of lights and sound. As you can see, it's a popular spot. In the University District of Hongdae, you can enjoy Seoul's vibrant nightlife and see plenty of street performers. down with a trip to a Jimjilban, a bathhouse that's open 24 hours. Change into the jammies they give you and enjoy a variety of saunas. There's also an ice room to cool down in. And plenty of hot tubs, so kick back and relax.